thank you uh, as a uh, in fact i only want to welcome all the panelists for today's webinar on pakistan canada it cooperation cooperation this consulate has been arranging webinars and virtual events on different important export sectors of pakistan earlier our webinars focused on exports of textile leather and food products in addition a very informative session was also organized on e-commerce as you know better than me that pakistani it companies are exporting to north american market including canada and there are many companies in us and canada which have back offices in pakistan however there is a feeling shared by people in both countries that pakistan has the potential to claim a much higher share of the market than it currently enjoys some very good news has been coming from pakistan there is a rise in investment startups as well as high growth in country software exports one of the key objective of today's uh, event is to enhance understanding of pakistan's it sector with respect to its capacity quality of talent export profile and infrastructure we are very much excited to hear your views the accumulated experience of it market and pakistan uh, and and of today's expert in this webinar is huge and we would like to hear from our distinguished panelists that what are the factors that are hampering the translation of this potential into actual business and what needs to be done at the operational level to improve it although the market status and opportunities would be shared by our panelists from canada um, however a few statistics are helpful for a basic understanding of the market size and growth of the ict sector in canada because i am based in toronto these days the data about us is already known and our companies are familiar with it there are over 44000 companies in the canadian information and communication technology sector and the large majority over 40000 fall within the software and computer services industries the sector consists mainly of small companies with approximately 37000 600 of them implying fewer than 10 percent there are only 119 large companies implying over 500 individuals including subsidies of foreign multinational corporations the ict sector contributes substantially to canada's gdp for example in 2020 the sector's gdp was around uh, uh, 97 billion dollar accounting for more than 5 percent of national gdp Since 2015 the ICT sector has posted a stronger annual growth than the total economy on the average uh, the compound annual growth rate in this sector has been 4.2% over a 5 year period compared to 0.7% for the overall canadian economy the sector is well positioned to benefit from the economy wide recovery as demand is expected to reflect accelerating adoption of many technology solutions and private and public investment in digital infrastructure and the sectors that are witnessing growth of it services in canada include banking and financial services insurance media and entertainment communication and technology consumer goods and retail healthcare and there are so many others like automotive chem chemicals hospitality travel energy and utilities transportation and logistics even oil and gas and education now i stop here we have a panel of distinguished experts we are looking forward to benefit from their insights on these themes many other related issues uh, before leaving i must share that we plan to have a follow up information sharing mechanism we shall invite panelists and attendees of today's webinar to be part of it the objective would be to continue to share developments opportunities in it market in north america and pakistan thank you